everyone. It's Molly. I'm back. Another pour. The last one that I did, I had too much paint in my cup and my design ended up kind of running off, but I got kind of the look I was going for. So I'm going to try it again. So um, I'll list all the colors below. This is a 10 inch by 10 inch canvas. Um, here while I talk, I'm going to put a little bit of red down. Um, I'm doing this for Valentine's Day rose pour. I've been doing a lot of roses or really just 3D techniques to see what I could do with a ring pour um, just for fun. Uh, and feel free to fast forward this part if you want. Um, and so the colors I'm using, I mixed together a maroon color out of some dioxazine purple and um, some scarlet, creative inspirations. I'm using one and a half, one to one and a half paint. Ooh, I got some other colors on mine, but that's okay. The colors will cover it. One and a half paint to um, pouring medium. I'll list my pouring medium below. I don't want to spend all the time talking about that. Um, so, I'm just gonna try it again and see what happens. And you guys let me know what you think. My hand off a little bit. And I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. So I've done my paint split. So I've done the fourths, different colors in each side. I'm using white, black, that maroon that I made, and a scarlet lake red. Um, and I have less cup in my paint. This is probably like 200 milliliters of paint. Um, I had 300 the last time it was too much. So I'm gonna, oh, that was a big air bubble that popped right there at the beginning. Um, you guys, before I do this, I just wanna say, if your pores don't come out like this, keep trying if you wanna try, but don't get frustrated. Art is about making art. It's about doing what you love. It's about enjoying it. So, so what if your painting doesn't look like anybody else's painting? That's okay. If you can't do these pores this way, do them however you want because they're still beautiful and they're still your creation. So that was my soapbox for tonight. Sorry. Okay, here we go. Just gonna start in the middle. And I noticed something when I did my last pour that the way that I layer my paints, come on, where's that red? I want that red to come out. There's that red. The way that I layer, okay, here's the white already. Hold on, I may have to talk to you guys a little bit later. So the way that I layer my paints ended up that the white was only showing around one side. Oh, I'm traveling too much, you guys. I'm gonna try to fix it. I'm gonna try to fix it. I can't talk to you and do this. Try to go slow around the middle. Until there's something a little funky right here so we'll just see what happens I'm gonna spin in a circle there are some air bubbles that are gonna pop so there will be a few little cells um, but we'll just kind of see what happens I don't want to go off my sides yet there we go Now I can go off the side, bring it back to the center. See, this is what I was talking about. 
those lines right there, those colors right there are a little bit different, but I'm liking this design. And I have a little blob right here. I'm gonna see if I can take this out. Hold on one second. was I twisted guys well, I'm already up in this corner so I might as well go back up to this corner and then bring it back down this one ended up being very wide see every single one of these is different and not one of them truly looks like a rose you know so but it doesn't matter because they're they're cool and and it's a creation and it's something that I made so that's why I like it you know let me know what you guys think um, but you know if I go in with an intention that's why I started doing this painting if I go in with an intention I don't want to get upset that it's not what I was trying for just enjoy what it became you know I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about, guys. Okay, I'm gonna take these off so that I can show you. Um, I don't like the, what happened over here. I like what happened in the center. So we'll see. I'm gonna try to take you off without shutting my phone down, which has been happening. There you go. I think I like the center of the other one better, but I'm out of red, so I'm not doing any more tonight. But it's definitely the way I layer the paints into the cup. But you know what? I still like it. I like the little curly Q thing that's happening right there. Not a super fan of the gray that mixed together there, but I like the pink that was made there. But I like it. All right, thank you guys. Bye.